in our continuing quest to bring you world's firsts, uh, here's one. Detox water, actually believe it or not, supplied by one of our cafeterias right here at McGill. What is it? Well, uh, upon questioning, they revealed that it was a mixture of cucumber, ginger, and God knows what other vegetables, spices, etc. So uh, we're going to give this a try. I've never tried detox water before. So here we go. Tastes sour, just like the theory behind it, which is extremely sour. Detox, well, our body does detox. We have kidney and liver, and that's what does the job. Any time that you hear that you can ingest something that will detox, you know that you're looking at a scam. The body just doesn't work like that. I wish it kind of tasted better. It, uh, not a pleasant uh, taste whatsoever. You know what? I, I think I better have something to, to get that taste out of my mouth. and Something spicy, like samosa. You know why? There's a Chinese study that came out, very, very interesting one. They surveyed lots of people, and over a seven-year period, what they found that men who ate spicy food at least once a week had about a 10% reduced chance of dying during that seven-year period. For women, it was even better. Why? Well, the researchers think it has something to do with capsaicin. That's the chemical found in, in hot peppers, and maybe it reduces respiratory problems. So. I think that is a better shot at it than this. Hmm. I can tell you, it tastes a lot better than this uh, detox stuff.